Hello everyone, this is Zilz and Ziltor, and we are back leveling up on the MSQ as always. I had to do a few side quests to get to level 36 to be able to continue. Oh, here we are. He who waited behind. So, what a curious twist of fate that Master Sid Garland would at last be found within our church. It defies imagination. Beg your pardon, Tara. You wish to find his airship, yes? I know not how much truth there is to it, but there is a tale known as the final flight of the em Enterprise, which grew popular in the wake of the Calamity. Much like the great Gubu Wall of Ulda, it states that the Enterprise flew northwest from Gerdania towards Corthus. If true, the airship would have passed through the Norse Shroud, likely over Falgord Float, the closest settlement to Corthus. Mayhap the Serpent Station there have records of the events that transpired that day. I had hoped you might rest from your journeys for a time, but I see that the world still has need of you in the Scions. Pray look after yourself and sit, Terra. Alright, so now we're going to hop over to Fall Gourd Float. And then we're going to head northwest. And talk to the, uh, to the following serpent, or er, fellow serpent people. Serpent people. Let's get our map out. Oh, I'm just right over there. Really? Okay. Further up. There we go. Let's see. So, ought I can assist you with, miss? Yes. The Enterprise? You speak of Master Garland's ship? Yes. Yes, I do. I, I need to refer to the records. I know that the airship was sighted overhead five years ago, clearly bound for Corthus. What became after it that I cannot say. If you wish to know more, pray speak with Vortifort or whatever at the spire. He was on duty that day and saw it with his own eyes. Alright, so yay, let's go. There we are. This is where we need to be. Let's go get shit done. Boop. see what he says. Fellow, oh, what a, god damn Lancers. Ah, alright, so I have served as a whaler for many years. Okay, that's great. The final fight of Enterprise. Alright, so twice on the eve of the Battle of Cartonneau, nigh uh, five years ago, I held the spire alone that night while the bulk of our, bulk of our forces marched to meet the enemy in the field. Then all of a sudden, the most fantastic airship I'd ever seen splits the sky overhead. I could only watch in shock as it disappeared over the mountains to the northwest. If the Enterprise wasn't destroyed during the Calamity, I'd wager it's still somewhere in Corthus. The astrolo ast uh, Astro- Oh my god! Seriously! Astrologians at the Observatorium may have records which could help. Alright, so... We're gonna have to go to the observatorium at Carthus now. And apparently these people don't like helping other people. So It's obvious I've never been here before. Alrighty. Now we go from Greenlands to Snowlands. Let's 
go get the chocobo thing first before I forget. Oh, and let's get repairs too. Wish to offer your services to House Durandare. All right. Do not mistake our courtesy for friendliness. The Holy See of Ishgard may allow foreigners to travel freely within these lands, but we do not intend to offer succor to strangers. All right. Hello and have mercy. Are you still here? Yeah, I'm still here. You may take shelter within our walls if you insist, but do not distract me while I'm on duty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Let's see. So we gotta go find someone over there. These LV peoples are like stuck up little bitches too. What's, what's with the, all the stuck up bitches in this game? First Alfie. Alfie needs to get knocked down a peg or two. Really. Really, Alfie, do you have to be a snob? Buddies, one. That means my chocobo gained some experience. Let's see if I went up a rank because I don't think it ever tells you. Or if they do, I miss it all the damn time. All right. If it wasn't for you, I reckon they would have finished me off. Despicable dragon-loving bastards. Death was a mercy they didn't deserve. All right. So we save this guy's bouté. Let's go check our chocobo progress. Skill. Nope. All right, so I have to hit rank three. Yep, we found your knight. <sighs> Alright. I'm not gonna go through every boring thing they say. Alright, so now we're gonna go to the observatorium. See what they say. Alright. Ah, uh, the lady came in search of the airship. This is highly unorthodox. It is true that we maintain meticulous records which stretch back generations. However, because this information is used to chart Dravonian activity, access is strictly controlled. If you would persist with your inquiries, pray seek an audience with Chief Astrologian Fulamore. Up above. Alright, so. We can't get access because the records are used for keeping tabs on the enemy. So we're probably gonna have to go prove our worth for us to even look at shit to get his stupid airship. No, absolutely not. Have you any inkling what it is, you ask? Well, I just want to know where the fucking airship is. 
Were our records to fall into the wrong hands, it could change the course of a war which has raged for generations. I do not speak of some mere spat between Southern nations. Ours is a holy crusade, and we are the arbiters of Holon's will. I will not put our great nation at risk. Certainly not to help the foreigner locate a missing airship, of all things. <coughs> uh. Pardon the intrusion. I wish to speak with you regarding the recent... Oh, I did not really say to guess. Blah, blah, blah. Your honor, you honor us with your presence, sir. The lady was just leaving. Yes, yes, I was just leaving. Because I was access denied. <sighs> Alright. Ah, uh, you must be the one who rescued the knight from those heretics. You come to us at an inconvenient time, I fear. Much has changed in the intervening years, and little for the better. While I wish you the best of luck in your search, I would also strongly advise caution. The snows can come quickly in Carthus. One moment you may feel as though you have a firm grasp on your surroundings, safe and secure in your knowledge, and the next you may find yourself in a wholly unfamiliar situation, blind to the dangers hidden by the blizzard. It would be wise for you to focus on a single landmark Waltz traveling. Do not give in to temptation and deviate from your course. So either he's threatening me or trying to give me a clue. I was not aware you aided the house in that fashion. Thank you, madam. Nevertheless, my decision stands. I cannot give you what you seek. Thank you for helping us, but fuck you. And your yellow looks shitty. Just so you know. Ooh, and necklace. Oh, yeah. All right, let's see. An associate of mine has yet to return from his expedition of the cliffs. East of the observatorium. Uh, he was adamant that he could conduct his observations alone. Despite the presence of Ixil in the vicinity, if you would seek out this astrologian and confirm that he is well, it would be a great comfort to me. Yeah, because I'm the babysitter. I'm the babysitter. Oh, where the hell are we going? Not there. Oh, here we go. We're going east. Ah, these stairs, like seriously, never ending stairs. Alright, I'm gonna go this way. This way. keyboard does weird things. Promise is not just me being stupid. Ooh. I got 
get hunties. That's it, just one. That was my hunting log entry order of the Twin Adder. Alright, what a relief to see someone other than a god's damn bird's birdman. I thought I could finish my work whilst the ax Ixel were away, but they returned far quicker than I anticipated. It was all I could do to hide and hope they might leave, but I froze. Obviously I'm not one of your damn knights. What? A man of House Durandare cannot be seen in the company of an unbeliever. Good day, madam. Well, you know what? How about you fucking find your own way back? How about you kill your shit? I said I help you. Asshole. I risk my life here. And my chocobo. Who's way more important than you. Damn stairs. Ugh. I can just eavesdrop onto the conversations. So they're discussing plans, but it looks like they're looking at stars. Okay, the arrogant fool returned not long before you arrived, muttering about the disgrace of having been rescued by an unbeliever. So was some right for underestimating the dangers our knights face every day. Alright, but you are eager to locate your airship. It may surprise you that by saving him, you have already aided your own cause. Yay. How stir and dare is quick to regard outsiders with suspicion, as it is their duty to sound the alarm at the first sign of Dravanian aggression. Yet you have already aided them twice, for which they are honor bound to repay you. Ha! Even so, they will not grant you access to the Observatorium's records. That is just as well, for there are other ways you might locate your missing airship. What I propose is that you petition Lord Portalane for an official. We're going to call him Lord Port. For an official introduction to the other high houses. The house, the word of House Durandare, carries tremendous weight in Ishgard. Should the captain consent, you would have little trouble obtaining information from the other high houses. Yay. It's not what you know, but who you know. And I know no one. You know, you would think that my previous deeds of slaying two primals would, like... Oh, you're the adventurer that slayed some primals, and so now you need the airship to slay a third primal? Well, here you go! I mean, but but then that would be too easy, right? Let's not make everything too easy. I'm just, I'm just saying that, you know, reputation should carry some adventuring weight. Just saying. Just saying. Alright. Mr. Port caused quite a stir in your short time here. First you slay two heretics and save a knight. Now I hear you have rescued a man of our house. I imagine you must desire something for your troubles. An introduction to the other high houses? I cannot deny that you have given us no cause to, to distrust you. 
but while you have performed two acts, you would have me to endorse you to three high houses. It's only fitting that you aid us one final time, wouldn't you agree? Nah. I guess I don't have a choice. Three for three. All right, so yes, we want to miss, or we want to find the missing airship. So what do we have to do? All right, so we have to go to a scene of a robbery and investigate. All right, over here. A lot of back and forth. Back and forth. Does it always snow here? Every time I've been here, it's always been snowing. It's ever bright and sunny outside? Oh, oops. I'm gonna go this way. So, got the stolen merchandise. Alright. God's bless ye, friend. It's all here, every last but uh but wait, the chest over there looks like it might have been pillaged. But he hells, that's the personal property of Lord Francil, too. Are you certain? Clearly an attempt was made to open it, but the lock appears to have held. Nevertheless, if you wish to verify the contents against your shipping manifest, be my guest. Fury take me, a Traconian rosary, and the possession of Lord Francil? Yet, perhaps this is not so difficult to fathom. House Hale is whispered to be infested with heretics. Thank you for bringing this matter to my attention, miss. I shall inform the Inquisitors immediately. Under these circumstances, I must strongly advise against associating with House Hale. I think I'm going to try to pronounce these names. These very, very Frenchy French names. Uh, your other introductions will need to be postponed as well. It is the duty of every Ishgardian to root out and destroy heretics. All else must wait until this matter is resolved. Great, so now I'm just involved in someone's shit politics. I just want to find a fucking airship! Uh, I'm gonna talk to now. Sit up there. Well, where the hell is 
use it. Is it in the building and I missed it? Oh. This guy. I lost my chocobo again. Alright. Come closer, lass, and listen well. This is for your ears only. Lord Francil is no heretic. He is a goodly righteous man, wholly dedicated to the cause. I know this because I served House Hale for years prior to the Calamity. You must go to Skyfire Locks and warn him of the coming storm. The Inquisitors are ruthless and will spare him no mercy. Speak to him of an Elderweiss and he will know you for a friend. Alright, so where the hell do I have to go? I have to go up here. Great. So this guy is being framed for being a heretic for some reason. He must have pissed in someone's cornflakes. Which is no doubt because all these elves and assholes are, well, assholes. I wonder if because of their, like, pedigrees or something. Pedigree snobs. I just want to find a goddamn airship. I didn't really want to be involved in your ship politics. There you go. Hey, looks like he's the same color as me. Maybe not. Can't tell with that shit yellow light. Hey, hey dude, you're going to be framed for being a heretic. Let's see. Are you seeking the audience of the bears of the white lily? I will wither the wild rose. Oh, I will go wither the wild rose blooms. Is that an Edelweiss in your pocket or are you happy to see me? <laughs> That's funny. I see Sir Carr has not forgotten my mother's favorite flower. A pity it has not been seen in Carthus since the calamity. You may speak freely here, friend. You're going to be framed as a heretic. Get the fuck out. That, that's absurd. I'd rather sooner die than become a thrall of the dragons. Alas, it matters little what I say at this point. Although the draconian rosary was not found in my possession, it will still be considered by many to be proof of my heresy. I must do my utmost to prove my innocence to the Inquisitors, for if they harbor even the slightest doubt, this will only add weight to the insistent accusation our house has suffered of late. It is as though the gods themselves are plotting our fall. Well, yeah, because you guys are like Game of Thrones type of bullshit. You risk much by coming here. It's only proper that I recompense you for this deed. Tell me what you desire and I'll do my... How about you tell me where the fucking airship is? Can you do that? A missing airship, I see. Alright. Uh, Lord Horshafant of House Fortom. Temps, whatever. Commands the garrison at Camp Dragonhead. Present to him this letter of introduction and he will surely be receptive to your needs. I just want to know where our fucking airship is. Ah. I'm going to go all the way up here. I just want to know where an airship is. <laughs> okay, let's collect the chocobo. Let's collect the etherite.
Let's go meet this Arshifont guy. Oh, there's Sid and Alfino. Maybe they'll poke somebody's ass to get this crap going. Hello, Mr. Elf. I just want to find a fucking airship. <sighs> uh, the unmistakable swagger of a well-traveled adventure. If you are come to pay respects, beat East friend. I am not the one to stand on formality. Truth be told, I would gladly welcome many more brave souls like yourself. But if chatter, pray tell me why you have come. I just want to find an airship! If there is any justice in this world, these charges will receive no serious consideration. It is beyond inconceivable. Ah, yes. The letter made mention of pressing matter for which you required assistance. What might that be? To find an airship! That's all I want to do. So this enterprise you speak of was last seen above Carthus before the Calamity five years ago. I fear it may prove difficult to find any eyewitnesses to these events, for while Ishgar did not participate in the Battle of Kartanu, we were embroiled in our own internal conflicts at the time. Of course you were. Why did everyone keep saying nevertheless? Ah. I will make inquiries on your behalf and share with you my findings in the future. In the meantime, please enjoy the hospitality of Camp Dragonhead. I will see that you are awarded every courtesy as the guest of House for Tom. I guess that's how you say that. At least he's not a douchebag. For once. Someone not a douchebag. Uh, to be 37 to wear that? What is better than what I have? Uh, not really. Only two levels. What does it look like, though? Well, that's a pretty blue, but not my color. And you can see my boobies! Let's see what it looks like with our color. There we go. Yeah. Accentuate those boobies. Alright, it may take some time before I receive any information regarding your missing airship. While you wait, mayhap you may or might indulge me in a small favor. But of course, because, you know, I'm the big errand girl. It is obvious to me that you know much and more the ways of war. I ask that you share that knowledge with our knights so that they may better be prepared in the next strike. One of my veteran knights is presently conducting a training session just beyond our western gate. Pray seek him out, introduce yourself, he will explain how you can help. Alright, so while I go gather your info, go do this menial shit task. You know, busy work. But at least he's not a dick about it. So that's good. I got that going for me, which is nice. Probably like the only guy in this place who isn't an asshole. A fine evening to you, Miss Lord Horshifont wants me to wants or tells me you possess a great deal of experience, certainly more than the green boys in me to test today. If you will allow, I would like to even the odds by setting all three against you. Lovely. What the hell is that all about? Not accidentally shit. Hi. Before it kills my chocobo. Yeah. Ah. 
Okay. I observed everything from the western wall. Splendid perfor performance, Terra. Why, thank you. Mayhap you have discerned this this deer in your short time here, but House Four Toms regards outsiders differently than the other high houses. We have no objections to employing adventurers and sell swords, for example, whereas the others have, for all intents and purposes, forbidden the practice. They do so at their peril. To disregard a man's talent solely because of the circumstances of his birth is short-sighted and foolish. You know, after watching your spar with her knights, I'm reminded that you are a woman of action. Doubtless you'd rather take a more active role in my inquiries, yes? But let us discuss how you could do just that. Should I go for the harness? Or the money? Harness? Or the money? I kind of like the way the harness looks. We'll go with that. Are you fucking kidding me? 37. Well. <sighs> I don't have time to run a dungeon right now, and I don't have time to palace. So this concludes this ending of the video, and when I do have time, I will find a boring way to level up. If I do a dungeon, what dungeon will it be? The Sunken Temple of Karn. Haven't done that yet. I know I haven't done a video with that, so maybe I'll do that later. Hopefully that might level me up. So, um, yeah, so that's it for this video then, obviously. So I will see you when I'm level 37, and we can continue. So this is Zilzin Ziltor, and I will see you next time. Bye!